In today's show, we're going to discuss ways that you can make sure your plan is able to overcome longevity risk. One of the biggest risks to anyone in retirement is longevity. What can you do by the numbers that's going to allow you to overcome longevity risk in your retirement? Let's roll. Time and time again, when retirees or those starting to plan for retirement are asked what their biggest concern is moving into retirement and then 10, 20, 30, maybe 40 years longer, by far, it's almost always running out of money before they run out of life. You know, am I going to live too long to outlive my money and wind up having to live with, you know, my son-in-law that I can't stand or, or whatever? Um, so we're going to discuss that. We're going to look at some facts and then we're going to look at some potential things that can help you overcome longevity risk. First, if you don't already have a copy of my book, Safe Money Retirement, Your Game Plan for Success, you owe it to yourself to get a free copy. We'll send you a copy absolutely free, no obligation. Just give us a call, 833-413-SAFE or log right onto our website, safemoneyretirement.com. You need this book because it is going to help you plan and be able to overcome longevity risk. That's the number one risk you need to take off the table, by far. That if you take longevity risk off the table, yes, there are still some other risks, but if you can take longevity risk off the table, you have taken a major piece of the challenges in retirement completely off the table. So let's first look at some numbers and see how this is going to relate. And then we'll get into some ways that you can overcome longevity risk. So first, what are the numbers now? If you are alive at 65 right now, these are relatively new numbers. At 65, males, our average life expectancy goes to 84.3. Females goes to 86.6. So males basically at 65 on average got about 19 years. Females got about 21 years. Now, you need to also keep in mind, one in four will live past 90, and one in 10 are going to live past 95. And with medical advancements, I think those numbers are just going to continue to go up, who knows how high. So the point is, you need to make sure that you are going to have enough income for you know, from 65 to 85 or from 65 to 95 or maybe even from 65 to 105 or longer. Well, how can you do that in this world that there's, you know, most people don't have a pension anymore. How can we do that? We're going to discuss that. One more thing that I think is interesting, uh, that I'm just looking at this, this report right now, a male that's born in 1961, when he gets to 62 years old, his average life expectancy is 84. If he makes it to 67, his average life expectancy goes up to 85. If he makes it to 70, his average life expectancy goes up to 86. So again, it's really important to make sure that you know what your long-term plan is and how you can take that longevity risk off the table, especially with all the medical advancements going on. I was just reading an article about three weeks ago. They now have little capsules that people can swallow with cameras that are so small, they can put a camera in the capsule, you can swallow it and it can go into your body and help take care of specific things. It's amazing the medical advancements that are coming and that are already here. So making sure we can take longevity risk off the table for as many people as possible is going to be absolutely huge and absolutely critical in making sure that they can enjoy their retirement. So how can we do that? What can we do to take running out of money before you run out of life totally off the table? Well, what we can do, first of all, is we can put uh, what you need for a guaranteed income when you retire at 65 or 70 or whenever you're retiring 62. I've got some clients that are retiring even earlier. Whenever you're going to retire, number one, we need to make sure you're going to have enough income to cover what you need when you retire. So that's the number one thing that we're going to do. And we're going to do that with a guaranteed lifetime income annuity from a top A-rated life insurance company. That's the first thing that we're going to do. That's going to give you the guarantees that you know that you, and if we set it up this way, you and your spouse will continue to get that paycheck for as long as you and or your spouse, you know, we can do it for both of you, as long as either one of you are breathing, that check's going to come. 
that check is going to just keep coming every single month. Now, not only does this help to take longevity risk off the table, it also helps to increase happiness in retirement. It also helps with wanting to spend that check. Because if you don't know you've got a check coming next month, the one you get this month, you might hold tight to the vest. But if you know there's another one coming next month, and then the month after there's another one coming, and then the month after that, it's a lot easier to spend that one because you know more is coming. Without a doubt, 100% more is coming. And that also lowers stress levels, which that, that's a whole other topic. We know that lowering stress in retirement is massive as far as the health benefits it can bring. So lowering those stress levels is huge, but that, that's almost another topic. But basically that's the first thing. That's step number one is we get you enough income when you retire. Step number two then is we make sure that you have got some income you can turn on later that will continue to grow that you can turn on later to help offset inflation. Once we have both of those things in place, that takes longevity risk off the table. Because what we will do is we'll sit down and we'll look at, okay, what are your expenses? What's your social security gonna be? And we'll determine when you're going to retire and what the social security is gonna be at that time. And then we're gonna look at how much do you need when you retire? Okay, well, we take care of that. Now, social security is gonna have the cost of living increases, of course, we know that it's got the colas, but sometimes the colas aren't enough. So if you get to a position where the COLA is not enough, we have some of those smaller accounts that are going that just continue to grow and continue to grow and continue to grow that you can turn on later to supplement your plan and your social security to make sure you've got enough. And then you can have more growing that you can turn on even later. That is how you overcome longevity risk. That is how you make sure you are not going to run out of money before you run out of life. This is imperative. This is the number one thing people need to focus on when they are planning for their retirement is they have got to make sure that they're going to have enough income for the rest of their lives, no matter what. And this is how you do it. This is how you overcome longevity risk. A guaranteed lifetime income annuity is the only product out there in the market. Let me say this again. The only plan, the only product out there in the market other than pensions and in a pension you would have had to gotten from a uh, employer. Most of us don't have that anymore. If you do, congratulations. But even then, a lot of them are too small to cover what you need. So what we do is we use guaranteed lifetime income annuities from top rated life insurance companies that have been around some of them for 150 years. We use these companies, they will guarantee they're gonna pay you as long as you live, as long as your wife lives as well, if we set it up that way. Uh, and then that's going to make sure that you're gonna have enough income for the rest of your life, take longevity risk totally off the table and make sure that you never run out of money before you run out of life. Shh. <laughs>